Hello, Cancer, my darlings, and welcome back to my channel, Lumen Moon Tarot. Cancer, thank you guys so, so much for all the well wishes, man. I, I, you guys know that I've got the flu, right? <laughs> I didn't know if I was going to do a reading for you um, tonight or not, but I was called to the table, and I'm totally um, in the zone here, Cancer. I'm in the zone. Um, but anyway, this reading is for the collective, so it may not be for all of you, right? Just take what resonates, Cancer, leave the rest behind. You guys know the drill. And thank you so much. I love you guys. Seriously, thank you for all the well wishes. I Man, I love you. And I hope you enjoyed your bonus reading for that, Cancer. Thank you. You showed me so much love today. Um, and thank you to everybody new here. Thank you to all of my subscribers. All right, so Cancer, what I'm seeing is this is, I feel like this is a divine masculine Okay, but they were called and they, they did not listen. The, uh, they did not listen. Okay, refusal of the call. Um, I feel like, I feel like somebody also thinks that you stole their dream. Okay, um, and now this, this, there's a masculine who wants your forgiveness. They've wanted it for a long time. They were told by the divine to communicate. Okay, they needed to talk. They needed to tell the truth. All right, they needed to ha show some strength and confidence, okay? And I feel like they failed that test. Um, and I'm feeling like there's a karmic who's been blocking this person from coming towards you. You could be dealing with a Pisces, a uh, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. I feel like this karmic is jealous, envious of you, watching you like a hawk, watching you live a dream life. You may be doing something that she always dreamt of doing, okay? Um, and you're doing it better. Or, I, I, or you could be moving to a, a dream home or a dream location. She feels like you stole her dream. I also feel like she, she feels like you stole this masculine. Um, I don't think you had anything to do with it, Cancer. I mean, your your energy is coming out as spirit of the river, okay? Um, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy, but also you're moving forward. You're moving towards a new adventure, change, right, with the five. So you don't, you're not even paying attention to these people, much less competing with anybody. But this Queen of Swords is ticked off, okay? She's upset because this masculine is upset and they're showing it. I feel like this masculine really is tr possibly trying to avoid this queen of swords. Um, they're in shutdown mode here in hermit energy. They just want to be alone. They may not even want to come home. They don't want to talk to this queen of swords. They certainly don't want to share passion with this queen of swords. Um, they're kind of like pulling away from her and she knows why. Now, I don't know if she, if you even know who she is. Like, you may not even know this person, this Queen of Swords, but she knows you. And she's angry, and she's upset, and she feels like you stole her dream. She sees you as an alchemist, a magician. We've got the magician out here twice, with the magician sword and the magician, okay? And you're having a new beginning, or... I'm, this is you, I, somebody thinks that you stole their dream. I don't know what that's about, you guys. Um, I don't know what that's about. The only thing I can tell you is like I can give you an example, okay? There was a time when I almost moved to Hawaii, okay? <laughs> um, everyone who's close to me knows I, I almost moved to Hawaii. And the divine changed their mind they they led me here instead for good reason okay they were trying to protect me but see at the time like a past like somebody from my past always wanted to move to Hawaii and live in Hawaii and so I'm feeling like um, that person may have been jealous at the time, okay, something like that, right? So maybe it's a, it's a move to a dream spot or you have a dream job 
that this car can't compete with, or you've got um, a dream car, or, you know, I don't know. It, she feels like you're living the dream and you're stealing her dream, okay? I've, and I, I feel like she already knows that this masculine is in love with you. They can't stop thinking about you. There are, this masculine is also very jealous and envious, I feel, because they're having some kind of blockage here. Um, with the Wheel of Fortune in reverse, uh, nothing's happening in their life. There's no forward movement. There's no new opportunities, okay? There's a complete blockage for them somehow. It could be, a, possibly this could be a business owner, right? Just say they're a business owner. They're not getting any business anymore. Everything seems to be going backwards. They could be losing business. Here, you're out here getting this big old ace of pentacles, right? Uh, either a lot of money, abundance, opportunities, a brand new beginning, whatever this is. Um, it could be a home purchase, something like that, right? And this person, your masculine, is over here broke. They're broke. They've got two pentacles. So you're doing better than them, and they can see it. Oh, believe me, both of these people are watching you close. And they're watching you rise above, it says rise above the fray, okay? You're rising above everything, all of their expectations. You're living somebody's dream out here. This karmic could have had dreams with this masculine, but they want to leave the karmic um, for you. They don't want to have anything to do with this karmic anymore. And I feel like... With all of this heat in between them, this is like anger, jealousy, rage, okay? That's really what I'm picking up on. And I feel like that with this on the bottom of the deck here, because I'm going to use this in a minute, um, there's a lot of screaming going on as well because your person is being led back to someone from their past, and that would be you. Now, this Queen of Swords, she's also keeping a secret, Okay, um, a secret that she doesn't want this masculine to know. Here's the thing. I feel like you're, you could be doing something very intuitive, okay, with the spirit of the, of the river. I feel like um, you could even be in the public eye here, living some kind of, doing some kind of dream job. Um, but I feel like you're, you know something or you're intuitively hitting on the truth um, she's upset because she's about to be found out that she's cheating on this masculine, all right? So she's trying to guard um, a secret, and that secret is, is that she's having an affair, possibly even in this divine masculine's bed. She's betraying them right behind their back. I feel like she's also talking a lot of crap about this masculine, so she's said a lot about them, okay? She's possibly, she could be the reason why this masculine, if they're a business owner, they're losing business or they're losing money. She's the reason because she's trashing their reputation behind the scenes. So she's hiding a couple of different, uh, maybe even quite a few secrets, okay? I feel like all these two do are fight with each other, okay? Um, this Queen of Swords, whoever this karmic is, uh, she could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. You could be dealing with a, this masculine, could be a Taurus, Aries, Virgo, Pisces, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. And now this masculine wants to, they want your forgiveness, okay? Yeah, look, they're mad. Ooh -hoo. Yeah, see, here you are. You're in this energy, the Empress in the Minor Arcana, making your, we're going to make our dreams come true. Yeah, that's the song I'm getting for your reading. It's the theme song from Laverne and Shirley, okay? <laughs> You're making your dreams come true. You're making their dreams come true, and you're living their dream. They see you as a thief. They see you as a dream thief, okay? 
Like, how dare you um, build a beautiful life for yourself and live a dream out here? Yeah, look, they can't stop watching you. This karmic is so jealous, Cancer, that um, she's losing her mind. Like, she's very volatile. She's very unpredictable here. This is somebody who could even have some mental instabilities, okay? Ooh, feeling like a clown. This one popped right out of my hand. Here's the thing. I feel like this masculine is slipping right from her fingers, okay? And you're not doing a thing. You don't have anything to do with these people. You're far too busy building your abundance and making your dreams come true and being an alchemist, okay? So, um, yeah, this karmic is feeling very embarrassed. She's embarrassed in the public eye because, um, you know, together these two cultivated other relationships too with other people, family and friends. And I feel like nobody knows that she's this nutty, okay? She may even be exposing herself at this point, like um, getting angry maybe in public things like that. She's going to embarrass herself. Either she already has or she will. Okay. There she's doing a lot of screaming. She's totally blocking your person like she will physically block them from leaving the house cuz she knows this masculine is is getting prepared to come towards you. Okay. Yet she is so mad, big, big mad. This is losing your mind kind of angry, okay? Yeah. Oh, boy, Cancer. Yeah, because your masculine is being led back to somebody from their past. I can't make this up, you guys. Yes. So um, she's just like standing in front of them, not letting them leave, um, knowing that they're coming towards you. I feel like this is what they fight about. Um, this is what they fight about on a daily basis. They fight about whether or not this person's coming towards you or it's more like when. I, I'm getting the sense that your person just, this is like hermit energy. And this person, I feel like at this point, they would rather hit the streets than be around this karmic. She's losing her mind, okay? She's showing her true side, and she can't control it. So I, I really feel like she's embarrassing herself. She could be very embarrassing in public as well. Because I just heard you can dress her up, but you can't take her anywhere. <laughs> That's what they said. Yeah, look, she look, and your person is so angry. I feel like this masculine is realizing that the only reason, and seriously, the only reason she ha she wants him to stay where they are, where he is, is because she doesn't want you to have this masculine. Okay, she doesn't want this masculine coming towards you. Because she has a new boyfriend on the side. You know, so she's, there's no love there. It's only this karmic wanting to win at all cost. Okay? And she's a schemer, a planner. She's, uh, your person is seeing her as absolutely evil. This is just being evil. Okay? So no wonder your person doesn't want to have anything to do with her. He's trying to avoid her because she's seriously, she pops off at anything. Um, he walks around on eggshells all the time around this karmic. Uh, and that's, it's to the point where I feel like this masculine doesn't even want to go home anymore. Okay? Yeah. She embarrasses him in public. She may be making him feel like a fool, okay, or this masculine. She may, this karmic may be making this masculine feel like a fool in public, okay? Um, and somebody may even get into a car accident here because, um, because of the, there's no anger management. There's road rage. 
This karmic is literally raging over this. Embarrassing your, your person, um, ruining their reputation maybe. Cheating on them, doing a whole lot of drinking. This karmic drinks a lot and when she gets drunk, I feel like she gets even more violent and vile, okay? Just want to say it's vile. Yeah. Give me just a couple more. Yeah, they're sad. A lot of screaming, okay? A lot of screaming and this masculine just kind of, they've been taking it this whole time. And I feel like now they're reaching a point where they just, they can't stand being around this karmic anymore, you guys. They just can't stand it. You know, she's done too much. She's acted too crazy. Okay? She's just, it's just too much. She's, and she's cheating in the background. So I, you know, this masculine is, I feel like that's going to be exposed and it's going to be it. I feel like that it's going to be exposed. Okay. And then she's going to be really embarrassed. Look what I saw. She's going to be really embarrassed then. Yep, because right now she's playing dumb. Yes, there's another soulmate connection. And she's playing dumb about it. I feel like your, your person maybe already is suspicious. He's already asked her about it, confronted her about it. Are you sure you're not seeing somebody else? Because, you know, whose shoes are these under my bed, right? <laughs> um, and she's like, no, I don't know what you're talking about. But here's these two um, straws in this cup. And the word two is on this menu. This card literally means playing stupid and having an affair. Okay, and there's that soulmate connection or whoever she's currently dating behind this person's back. And I feel like all she wanted from your person was um, financial, uh, financial support. Okay, maybe, um, maybe she has kids with this masculine or the, I mean, he could be supporting her kids and they may not even be his. Okay, she just wanted the money, you guys. And she went she may have gone through a lot of money cuz now this masculine's broke. Yeah, this look, your masculine's going to get some kind of photo evidence or some kind of evidence that this karmic is having an affair, okay? Or um cheating, right? And when they get that evidence, it's going to be over. Give me one more for cancer. It's kind of an, an everything reading. Yeah, and this karmic may actually end up pregnant with this um, knight of wands baby. Okay, this is her other person right here, the knight of wands. And this is a pregnancy test. Okay, so... Yeah, everybody's under judgment in that situation. And Cancer, honestly, you're just out here living a dream, okay? I feel like people are, just, whoever this is, is jealous and upset because they see you as a dream thief, okay? But, um, hey, I'm seeing, I'm seeing you as the alchemist here, getting wish fulfillment, becoming abundant. Just keep doing what you're doing. Focus on yourself and your personal growth and your new adventure and all of your wins okay focus on that in the meantime this masculine is stuck in a karmic situation but they're finding out the truth it's gonna be exposed they're gonna get evidence and um yeah just know that i don't know which one thinks you're a dream thief but i, I feel like it's this karmic there's just so much going on in this reading you guys Anyway, um, Cancer, listen, that's what I've got for tonight's reading. Um, I hope this helps. I hope it resonates. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe, you guys. Join this awesome soul tribe. And until next time, Cancer, take care of you and peace out.